They've got a boat inbound. Probably trying to take advantage of the fact that water will kill you. I've got fuel leaking all over the place, so you've got to catch up to us or we're going to lose the sphere again. <coughs> Damn, gas grenades. so I gotta put it down. Get your ass down there and stop them! I'll follow you on foot as soon as I can. only a few minutes out. Hurry up! You know, I had that thing in my hands once. Kessler asked me to hold it while he adjusted some cables during a test. I could feel it pulsing, like something was inside and trying to get out. It's not right. And everyone wants it. The big lightning strike of yours should destroy its protective container. Then we can blow the sphere sky high. <sighs> How many lives has that thing destroyed? Corrupted. I can't risk it falling into the wrong hands. But it gave me powers once before. If I use it again, it could make me twice as strong. And then no one would dare challenge me. I pick up the ray sphere and instantly feel it leeching off me, humming and crackling, growing in power. As I activate it, I think of Trish, how she died, and I swear to myself that I will never let something like that happen again. Then John rips it away, telling me I'm crazy, screaming, but it's too late. The ray sphere breaks open, creating a vortex. 
I tear his jaw apart, and I run. John and the Ray Sphere are gone. Reduced to ashes. But I got what I wanted. Yeah, that feels good.